Hey, I don't know how many of you heard about what uh, Obama said today, but they're basically mandating all public schools in the entire nation that we have to open up our bathrooms, especially uh, girls' bathrooms to boys. Uh, even if there's not a force of law behind that, the fact that the Department of Justice and Obama and Department of Education is doing this, it's leading us into absolute chaos. Here's the interesting thing. You guys remember the movie The Dark Knight when the Joker is hanging off the building and uh, Batman is holding on to him and, he, and Batman's like, what do you want? And the Joker just says, chaos. Well, that's what we're experiencing right now. What you need to know is that the issue is never the issue. The issue is always the revolution. Back last summer when it was the, uh, the Obergefell decision with the Supreme Court legalizing gay marriage, that was never the issue. Today, having uh, transgender folks go into bathrooms that's going to open up a loophole for deviant men to go in and prey upon our women and girls, uh, you know, that's still not the issue. The issue is the revolution, and the revolution is chaos. And this is what it is. It's that, it's that you know, the enemy wants nothing more than to destroy not only marriage, but he wants to destroy the family. He wants to destroy you individually. He wants total and utter destruction. And that's what we're seeing taking place right now. You know, and the only way to have chaos is for you to have either bad laws or no law at all. And these, we're, we're starting to see some bad, bad laws. You know, when law is based on a subjective standard for people's comfort instead of an objective standard for people's safety, then chaos is the only thing that can ensue. So I uh, decided to let Jason speak on this one. So you did a good job, Jason, my brother. <laughs> he never lets me talk. The, so devil comes, the devil comes to rob, kill, and to destroy, but Jesus comes that we may have life and have it to the full. Now's the time for us to turn to Jesus as a nation. Yeah, we need